channel. So for this week's video, I thought I would do a list of a few of my fiber resolutions for 2018. So these are exactly like New Year's resolutions, but these are more specific to me and my journey with fibromyalgia. So one of my first resolutions is learning when to take a break and learning when to push myself, which is something I've kind of always struggled with, but especially with my fibromyalgia. I'm someone who just wants to get it done and get it done right and I like to do a lot of things so I put a lot on my plate for myself but it's hard for me to know when I need to pull back and give myself a break because I'm just a go-getter and I want to be able to do as many things as I can but there are times where I do need to tell myself you need to stop, you need to slow down, you need to accept help from others. That's very hard for me to do because I'm super self-sufficient, but that is something I do really want to work on for 2018. So my second fiber resolution for 2018 is to be more consistent. And this kind of pertains to my self-care. So as I've mentioned before, I try new things all the time but I'm not consistent with them as far as giving them enough time to see if they actually work. I'm kind of like, if I try this for a month and it's not working after that month, I just kind of give up on it. I'm definitely the kind of person that wants quick results and with things that are helping treat fibromyalgia, they're not always quick results. So I definitely need to be someone who's more consistent and who sticks with things for longer than a month because I need to realize that some things do take a little bit longer to take effect. So I am going to try to have more patience, kind of in all aspects of life, but with fibro mostly. <laughs> My third fibro resolution is to have continued optimism. As I previously mentioned in other videos, Keeping a positive mindset and having as much optimism about life and, and fibromyalgia and my life with fibromyalgia is something that really helps me get through every day. It's just knowing that someday I will find the right thing to help treat my fibromyalgia. Someday maybe there will be a cure for fibromyalgia. So just keeping that track, not having tunnel vision for it, but just keeping that always in the back of my mind that things will get better. It may take some time, but it's there. It will get there. And I said as well, optimism for me is something that I try to share with others. So making other people happy and smile and laugh is a way that I kind of self-soothe or is a way that I kind of make myself feel better as well as helping others. So continued optimism for myself, but I also want to be able to continue to spread that to others. So those are my fiber resolutions for 2018. I didn't want to make a big list, I kind of just wanted to keep those three so that I can really focus and strive to meet those goals that I have for myself. And in the comments, if you guys have any fiber resolutions or even just any regular resolutions for 2018, leave them down below. If you missed my last video, you can click up here to watch that. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!